Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded Dead God Plus series. We're jumping in again for another run. Why am I at a minus one streak? What what happened last episode? I don't remember. Anyways, was it was it Tainted Apollyon? No, not Apollyon. Tainted Andromeda? I can't remember. Anyways, uh, I do just have to say I have unfortunately disabled the mod that we recently installed. I uh, can't remember the name of it now. It was... It's just hard to pronounce. It's like Apoki Rate, some Apoka something or other on the rocks. Great mod, but unfortunately, I did some testing and it was causing major, major FPS drops. So I've had to remove it for now. But I am perfectly willing to re enable it once we get to a stage where the mod isn't causing as much lag. Um, so, anyways, let's just jump in and randomize. And we get Tainted Forgotten. What a fun one. What a fun one. I'm very excited for this. I haven't actually played Tint Forgotten in a good while. But yeah, we'll see how this goes. We'll see how this goes. We've started with Goathead, which is pretty darn positive, um, I would have to say. Get a range up as well, which is really good. And a health up. Okay. Good start. Very good start indeed. But yeah, okay. So getting Goathead to start is pretty incredible. I don't really know how good a fire upgrade is here. Ooh, smelt a random trinket onto us. Hell yes. Chance to fire um, piercing shots doesn't really affect us, but I'll take it. Okay. But yeah, this is this is good stuff. This is a really, really good start. Get our little ghostly mini Isaac here. Whack, whack, whack. Should probably go for that chest. But yeah, go, go ahead to start does mean a lot for us. I think, does do, does that mean we get a go ahead on, uh, not a go ahead, a devil deal on this first floor? I don't actually know. Also, what do our mini Isaacs even do right now? <laughs> Do they, like, do they attack things? I don't know. Okay, no, they shoot stuff. They do shoot stuff. Okay, that's interesting. I like that. Right, we do have three bombs, so I think uh, looking for a secret room here is a pretty good idea. I think we've got a very good chance of it being here, to be honest. So let's just try that out. And it was indeed. Double keys, not the best that we can get, but pretty, pretty good. Uh, let's keep on keeping on. Um, And for the question of the day today... What is your budget superpower? What what would be your really terrible... If you could have any just stupid, really terrible, almost useless superpower, what would it be? I've seen a lot of funny ones. I like a lot of them. I can't remember... My, 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 me and my friend were discussing this the other day. This is kind of why it's on, on my mind. We were saying it'd be really fun if you could travel through walls, but only two inches through walls. Like, you, you couldn't actually fully go through basically any wall unless it was thinner than two inches. Uh, but what you can do is you can partially go through any other solid wall. But we were saying that it's like so unbelievably useless, apart from maybe like for like pranking people, because you could just like, like put their belongings like two inches into a wall and then leave them there. <laughs> and we were saying it could be like, the the only things I could really think about it being actually very good for um, is like storing, storing away things. We were saying like you could like put all your money that's in note form inside of all of your walls and then just reach in and grab them whenever you want. Um, <laughs> we're just saying it's like a very convenient way to, to store things. Oh, are you kidding me? I got hit for that. That's so silly. That's so silly. I threw this guy right at it. Apparently that was not enough. Okay. Let's keep her going here. Yeah, I don't I, like I have had some other introductions of lag recently that I'm not a hundred percent certain on what they've been caused by. Apparently the Eternal Enemies mod does cause a bit of lag here and there. So it might be due to that, but that's a mod that I don't really want to disable because I, I like it adding the extra bit of difficulty that we've got going on right now. I'm, I'm really enjoying it actually. I know I shouldn't have gone to pick him up there. It was a very bad idea, but I tried it anyways. Okay, there you go. Ooh, I've just noticed something. When, when we get the Rebirth Care, sometimes we can insta-kill straight away. I don't know why I'm not swinging at these guys, because yeah, the, the, the swing does like damage over frames, so we can get a little bit of extra damage out of that. Get this. Ooh, technology definitely. Oh. Do you know, I like technology, but Hemolacria would have been real good. Yeah, he, uh, technology is really good for this though, because we do get basically like a Tech X style ring that we can utilize. I like that a lot. Grab a few more babies. Keep them along with us. Well, there's like a there's like a full. That was a really bad hit there. Oh, that was two really bad hits there. Oh my god, can you calm down, game? 
That was too much. <laughs> the, uh, the the gas there was just not doing well for me. Not doing well at all. Okay, nice. Okay, we're doing really well, though. We're doing really well. Let's just ignore the fact that I've lost a bit of HP here. I don't think our first devil deal here is really going to be too much of use to us. I don't think it's going to be great. Okay. Head our way through. We did get, unfortunately... An Eternal Colostomia, which I have literally no idea what this guy does. So far, not too much difference. Ow. Could you, like, yeah, thank you, blow up all of this gas so I can actually get somewhere and do things? Yeah, th oh, this is going to be... This is brutal. This is going to hit me. Like, there's nothing I can do again. Oh, no, no, it didn't hit me. This is pretty brutal with this character, I've got to say. This is really brutal with this character. There's just gas clouds literally everywhere. I didn't get hit again somehow. Okay. And I'm just... Because he's moving so much, I can't bloody throw at him. There's just so much gas. So much gas. This is incredibly, incredibly difficult. I kind of need to bomb him, is what I'm thinking. Oh, Lord. Okay, we've taken way too much damage already this fight. I think we're going to die on this fight, you know. I, I genuinely think it's going to be a really, really hard time for us not getting killed here. Okay, that, that might have saved us. That was a really bad hit right there. Okay. I saved myself a little bit there. That was a lot of damage to take. Obviously, I'll check my Devil Deal just in case, but it's unlikely we can grab it. Um... Yeah, unfortunately, both things that I'd want, especially Dark Bomb there, but two things that I cannot get. Oh, well, it is what it is. Let's keep her going. That was a little bit of a, a risky bisky. Not very happy about that. But let's, uh, let's keep her going nonetheless. Let's keep her going nonetheless. Okay, we've got a Rainbow Heart in here we don't need. Ooh, we've got an Eternal little boss fight in here. I'll actually take a little look in there. Okay, so two pills of the same kind. Both puberty's actually kind of okay. Getting a health upgrade out of that would be kind of nice. Jar of Wisps is honestly a great idea for us here. Do realize we, we do have some eternal enemies we're going to have to fight now. This is actually fixed now. It was broken for a little while. For some reason, I wasn't getting eternal enemies when I should have been. I don't know what fixed it. I don't know if the mod got updated or something, but it seems to be doing better now. Okay, so this guy shouldn't be... Okay, there was a there was a little maggot there that I didn't see. Shouldn't be too bad. Okay. Just keep safe, keep safe. There we go. Okay, that wasn't so bad, and we got a soul out of it. Jar of Wisps is honestly really, really good to get this early on. Let's let all of these guys throw up. Wish I had a little bit more HP, though. I did just pick up a Soul Heart and immediately lost it, but that's... It is what it is, I guess. Right. Okay. Little bit saucy. The, the baby ghosts aren't actually very good. The, they're uh, not doing a lot of damage, but more importantly, they're kind of knocking enemies around in ways that I do not like. There's a mirror room. That's a weird-looking mirror room. And it's also not marked on the map. Is that really a mirror room, or is that like a... A glitchy mirror room. What the hell's going on with that? Oh, God. What What is firing all of these shots? Is that another Eternal one of you? Oh, no. You're just a regular one. Okay. Oh, my God. That was close. Where are you? Where are you? Trying to get him, but having a little bit of a hard time. And there you go. But, yeah, I, I, I just love the idea of thinking about, like, budget superpowers. They're so funny. They're so funny. Oh, my God. Ah. One that I saw that was that was really gross, and I've got to make it. I've got to wait another thirty seconds to make it past ten minutes so I don't get demonetized for this. Um, but I'll say it in a few seconds. Uh, but I, I think it's really funny, so I do want to actually <laughs> mention it. How did that not kill you? Okay. How did that not kill you? But there you go. So still, jar of wisps is pretty bad. But like I said, jar of wisps as we go on will get better and better. Like, if, if you haven't seen Jarrowitz before, I'm sure everyone has, but, but we're going to scale up 
the amount of wisps we get every time we use it. But it's on a very high charge, so it does take a while to get started with it. Oh, that was such a bad hit. I thought they were I thought we were all done with that. But yeah, the, the budget superpower was like you can um you can teleport, but only as far as you can ejaculate. <laughs> and I just found that so funny. <laughs> Okay, what we got here? Fire flares up and hurts enemies. Yeah, let's go with that. Box of spiders wouldn't have been very good for us anyway, so I'm pretty happy with my choice. The speed upgrade is mainly what enticed me, but the fire flaring up thing is pretty good. Okay, you stop. And it's boss time. Okay, so this guy's really not going to be too hard at all, is he? Especially with tech going on. In fact, let's get a bomb. Wow, that bomb was terrible. I was like, let's get a bomb. And it did not like the idea of that, did it? Okay. Don't worry, don't worry about it. We're completely fine here. Sucked into the void. We got Goat Head uh, Angel Deal, which is pretty good. I'll take those pills after. We did get some range ups. Oh, lovely. We got Breath of Life. Oh, nice. What a great thing for us to get here. Adore that. Sadly, no soul hearts there either. We did get two range upgrades, which is really nice. We need a balls of steel, really. We got a health up there. Health up's good enough. Let's keep it going. So I think now we're locked into Goat Head Angel deals, which is really nice, which I get, people keep telling me is and isn't possible. Okay, no, we're not locked in, but still. Ooh, jetpack. Actually, jetpack's kind of worthless. Like, it gives us flight, but we don't really need flight. I'm not going to bother with that. The care shroom's really nice. It'd be nice if we can get that item that gives us more care shrooms. That'd be, that'd be super useful. Okay, don't really care about that. I I never trust myself with that um, that that um, rune stone, whatever they call them, because the the, the soul of Lazarus. Because I just know that I'm going to accidentally use it sometime and kill myself. It's just like, it's it's a foregone conclusion that that will happen. I have to say, I don't think I've ever had technology as this guy. It's proving to be pretty good. Okay, you are producing a lot of spiders, sir. Because it means that if, even if we mi miss our throw, we still do get some damage out of it. Okay, now we're on to two wisps. As I said, it does scale slowly. It's definitely one of those things where getting a few battery charges with it can really scale it up quite quickly. Also, wisps are effectively useless for us. So as you can see, we've already put out the wisp that we gained because we're throwing this dude straight away. Why can't... Okay, maybe we do need flight. I always thought you could throw over gaps. Apparently, you cannot. Apparently, you cannot. So maybe we do need flight. Adoption papers is incredible. So let's check out the shop before we do anything else. Yeah, like, look, I, I just threw that guy way over these gaps. So why didn't... Why is it not throwing over gaps sometimes? That's peculiar. Let's check this out. That's unfortunately just completely useless for us. I don't know why these guys aren't willing to ch steal my charges here, you know. I have charges. Yeah, that's unfortunately just... That's new. Uh, just terrible because it has to charge up and we don't charge up as this guy. Ah, interesting. So if I throw... Ah, okay. I've got a little bit of ways of doing a little bit of extra damage with my... Oh, I got kind of telefragged there. That was my own fault, but I did get a little bit telefragged. Like, look, why can't I throw over these gaps? This is so confusing. I really thought you could throw the gaps. And in some rooms I can and some rooms I can't. It's just... It's a whole bucket of confusion right now. I'm so confused as to why it's working in some rooms and not in others. Which definitely ma makes me want to get the jetpack even more. It's as if some rooms it gives us flight and some rooms it doesn't. I'm really confused as to why that is. It's like if I throw it a in a certain way. Maybe it, it might just be that I just haven't played this character in a while and I'm forgetting how he works. I mean, he might have always worked this way and I'm just silly. Right, so we got the ability to buy two... Oh, I was going to say two familiars here, but unfortunately we don't. Oh, wait. The Herming goes after the uh, the Burns and not us. This is preferable. Far preferable. Does mean we have a lot more money to play around with now, which makes me definitely want to go for Jetpack. With 40 big smackaroos there. So let's let's go and get it. 
I do like the fact that you can travel through rooms a bit quicker with this guy. Always entertaining to me. Right, so let's play this a little bit. Please don't take all my money. Okay, we got it. Clear rune there as well. I'm not that bothered about clear rune there. Okay, so... <laughs> <laughs> Forgotten is looking particularly weird now, but we shouldn't have any tomfoolery with not being able to throw over gaps anymore, which is particularly nice. Yeah, there you go. We can throw straight over that gap. Okay, so that, that, that should help us out a little bit. Also, actually, something I didn't really think about with Jetpack, the fire that we produce is going to land directly on top of enemies dealing some extra damage. Jetpack does produce small fires as you move along here, so could end up being more beneficial than I initially thought it was. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I like that. I like that a lot. Ah! Hate this enemy. Hate this enemy with a passion. Just do your thing so I can kill you. Okay, go on fire now. Good. Need a way to... I, I need to... There's a few mods that let you recycle hearts as other characters. Um, I think I'm going to go and, uh, and grab those. I th I th they, are, they are a little on the strong side, but I do quite like them. It like works like Tainted Judas and um, Tainted Bethany and this character. Characters, uh, not Tainted Bethany, sorry, she already, she already has a use for hearts. But you know what I mean, it's like a bunch of different characters that don't normally have use for hearts actually get the use, which I, I really like. We have a cracked key here, I don't really have an inkling of what I can do with a cracked key here. Um, maybe at the top of our shop could be potentially a good one. Unfortunately not. I was hoping that would be something quite great, but... Yeah, the, the, the lighting on fire is pretty good. And and the wisps, while now are pretty useless, once we get up to the, like, six, seven, eight uses of wisps each time, they are going to do a good amount of damage. I did just kind of walk right into this boss here. Okay, good. Definitely need some more HP. That's our, our core issue right now. And we got a devil deal. I was really hoping for an angel there. Yeah, unfortunately a devil deal that we cannot take. Right. Hopefully next time we get a shop because we've got adoption papers now. At the minute, it's a little bit annoying that we didn't. But we still have 20 cents to go at. So I still think it's, it's valid and useful. Interesting little room here. Not so interesting anymore. Yeah, look at that. The amount of fire damage we do there. Well, it like, stops directly on top of an enemy. And the fire damage is really nice. Because you've all escaped now. Can you pop your head up, sir? So we can kill you. Thank you. Okay, you're just standing right in front of the rock spews. It's a bad idea, sir. I'm taking pills the whole time here because we've already been taking a lot of pills. So it's kind of like, why, why stop? I know I've already seen quite a lot of the good pills. Okay, let's be careful. We do have an eternal enemy here. Oh, God. Well, I was going to say we're one hit away from death. We're not actually. I thought we'd uh, gotten hit again, but we didn't. Ooh, horse pill. Oh, it's a horse addicted pill, though. Why? Does that even do anything? I just used it because why not? Because it only lasts a room. Maybe now it, it lasts longer than a room, and it'll it'll be something that um, is my mutually assured destruction, as that as that uh, pop-up just said. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. Now that's useful. Especially with the Emperor card as well, thank you. I like that a lot. Probably won't use the Emperor card yet, but once we get to the womb and stuff, it'll be pretty useful. This guy's fast as hell. Okay, champion boy, he might give us some batteries actually. Come on, there's a battery at least. I was hoping for a few more than just the one, but I'll accept. Okay, there's three. That's good. Good. That was that was good enough. And we got a special wisp this time. I might want to actually go and destroy all of those um, all of those skulls back there because there was a lot of them grouped up very closely. I kind of like the fact that a laser ring kind of looks like it's setting enemies on fire now because I feel like that's thematic. Right. Let's check this off. Ah, no cards or anything. Another unidentified pill. Tears up. Decently useful. And we drop a drop our guy on a boss. This is depths one, so let's just do the boss right now. It's war. What is he good for? Bit of a tricky room there, but it actually was it kind of went okay there. 
Ooh, bad hits. I'm taking some bad damage here, but it's just because I'm playing quite aggressively, which I think is probably a bad idea, but hey her. I'm just trying to kite him around my body rather than picking up and throwing for the most part. That seems to be working a little bit better. But we got him. Cuba meat's actually kind of okay. Yet another devil deal that we cannot partake in. Although the pact here is going to let us. Good, good. That's kind of why I've been constantly checking. We've been really needing a damage upgrade, so I was hoping for something such as the pact. We didn't lose any HP and we gained tears and damage. I think that's pretty worthwhile. I think the, the chance for black hearts here is, is too good to not try and take. We did get a Soul of Isaac, which I was not expecting. Uh, that might actually end up being incredibly useful on our shop. Just because of adoption papers, we could get some really good uh, fellas. I'm really hoping for like a Twisted Pair or something. Even like a Bob's Brain, I think, would work quite well right now. Um, it wouldn't be the most ideal pickup, obviously, but I think it would do a good job. Good, good. Let's make our way down. Don't know where our shop is right now, at least, but we'll make our way. Okay. Slightly difficult room. Lots of burnies, but we're good. But yeah, how has everyone been recently? Are people, are people still playing a lot of Isaac, or are you guys kind of here just for the commentary? Just for your daily dose? What's what's the deal? So we got Swallow here. Um, so I think we definitely grabbed this. I'm a little... Let's, let's try this first. I'm a little... Thingy, I don't know. Uh, that's that's really good, actually. Okay, so now I think we try and re-roll a little bit here. Then we Soul of Isaac on these two. Oh, of course. Okay, so that doesn't really work the way I wanted it to, but a cheap black candle is actually really good, so I'll take it. And Blue Baby's only friend is not... Even though it's only 5 cent, it's still not really what I want. Let's bomb it. And Mended Knife. I like Mended Knife. Mended Knife is essentially just the completed knife, but it does a lot of damage, so I'm really happy to have it. It's going to be a lot of extra damage for us. Extra key there, why not? I realize I could have bought some soul hearts during all of that, and that probably would have been the smarter idea. But I committed to, to, to buying some friends. Oh, that was a bad hit. I committed to buying some friends, and I'm going to stick by that decision. Good. You see, we're killing things a lot faster now. Check this out. This is very good. I'm glad that I went through all this and grabbed this. We've now got... A hell of a lot more money, which means we can start doing some upgrades. I don't know if you can choose what you upgrade first. I really don't. Okay. This mended knife is real good. And black a black candle as a pickup in general is just really nice for us too. Oh what the hell? I did not know that could happen. It picked up my body and just threw me out of the room. Do you know what? I'm absolutely fine with that. Right. Um, yeah, if I can select the Mended Knife to upgrade, because I believe it is compatible, then I will. But I don't know if you can specifically pick what you want to upgrade. Oh, wait. None are compatible anyways. So we'll just buy the Soul Heart. I'll buy this as well. Why not? Hey, give me some money back. Good, good. Okay, I thought the Mended Knife was compatible, but it's not. That's fine. We did drop an Emperor card. I think it was here. There you go. Definitely grab that. And honestly, this has been a pretty successful floor. Let's uh, try and get another Black Heart or something here, though. We did get a card. Unfortunately, it's a Lovers. And let's quickly check this out as well with, with all the bombs we've got. Damn it. That's unfortunate, but I'm not going to rush it. We could buy whatever the other Devil deal was now, but it isn't. it's unfortunately Ghost Baby. Not that interested in Ghost Baby. I have to say, not really a top priority for me right now. I think we've 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 landed ourselves in a decent position here. I think we've got good enough stats. They're not great. I will say our damage is kind of lacking, but we've got ourselves good-ish stats, and um, this is quite a difficult position to be in. And also, our items are coming together quite nicely. 
I think we've now got to the point with our Jar of Wisps where it is pretty useful every time we use it just for the damage and that's it. Even if we don't get any shots off with it. Check this out again. We did get the candle. I was a little bit kind of hoping that we'd grab, um, that we'd grab a restock machine there to make that a little bit better, but that's okay. That kind of speaks second secret room to me, so let's try it out. There you go. Is this, this is just the troll room, isn't it? Yeah. Unfortunate. Just the troll room. Okay, now let's power through. There you go. Another cracked key here. Do you know what? Just pop it there. Why not? It worked out. We got our ultra secret room. Wasn't expecting it. Now, this is an interesting development. Because the Jar of Wisps is particularly good. But Abyss, I think, could be a lot better. So let's Abyss. Just because just it's going to increase our damage output a lot. And we can recycle some items that we don't end up needing. Which is going to be a, a good amount from now until the end of the run. Oh, I thought the uh, shots would stop, but they don't. Like, already we got some uh, interesting flies here. Sadly, no soul heart there. We got ourselves spawns two batteries. Not actually that useful anymore. If I'd have got that with a jar of wisps, that would have been pretty good. Okay. Quickly pop this here. Another mega chest. It's a baby mega chest, but it is a mega chest. Oh god. Game did not like that at all. Game did not like that. But we've managed to gain ourselves a good amount of consumables there. Is this an eternal ghost? That guy was big. Oh, is, uh, I th yeah, he is eternal. He is firing a lot more shots than normal. I think we killed him though. Yeah. Easy. Okay, still haven't found our item room yet. Let's go grab that. Ooh, a spicy red chest for us. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Every time I'm like, ooh, something nice, the game's like, ha ha ha. Funny if I trolled you. How about that? Oh, that was a really bad hit. I just took a full hit of damage for basically no reason other than my own stupidity. It's okay. Health isn't terrible anymore. I mean, going down to the womb, we've not got great HP for that, I'll be honest. But it's no longer dire. The Scented Candle's actually doing a good job as well. Okay. Item room, here we are. Hopefully, we get a good item. If not, just something that we can turn into a Locust would be rather, rather tasty. This'll, this'll only give us a basic Locust, so I'd rather pick it up. But it's... I, it's not a great item for now. Like, getting extra wisps is kind of nice, but as this character, the wisps are going to die relatively quickly anyways, but also it's pretty late into the run, making it not all too useful. But I'm happy to have it. But yeah, having... I didn't even say anything about it, but having uh, Cuba meat here is actually kind of nice as well, just for an extra bit of damage here and there. Yeah, nice. We did get hit once there, but that's not all so bad. Uh, we will just take the Polaroid here. And... Eh, none of them really appeal to me. Not really going to get anything much out of those. There you go. Okay. Now... Uncertainty is kind of interesting. Changes your stats each time you take damage. Boy, that could be a confusing one. That can end up being a really good trinket because you can drop it at any given time. So you can get really good stats and then drop it. But obviously, you have to get hit for trigger. And the problem being, if you get really, really bad stats multiple times in a row, you're going to have to spend a considerable amount of HP trying to get back to a good position. When I believe, at least at the minute, we're already in an okay-ish position. So I don't really want to squander the media, the like meteor, meteority, meteor, mediocre. The what's the what's the mediocre word I'm looking for? 
I can't... Mediocrity. Yeah, okay. Health down plus getting hit in this room has kind of uh, balked us up. Not very happy about that. Not very happy about that at all. In fact, that might be part of our demise here, but I'll pretend it didn't happen and we'll just carry on with our day. Black Sack could give me a black heart. There you go. We gulped our trinket, which unfortunately is completely useless at this point. God damn, the big troll bombs. They are really trolling me today. Hopefully we get a straight shot straight to the boss here, which honestly it kind of looks like we're getting right now. Like, I, s I always say that like a second too, stu too soon. I'm like, this room will be the way to the boss. And the game's like, <laughs> turtle melon. You think you know this game. You think 1,400 hours will give you the knowledge you need to navigate the womb correctly? You fool. You absolute fool. It is never the case. It's okay, though. It should be this way. If it's the other way, I'm going to throw it down. I'm going to re-out. But I'm, I'm certainly convinced it's this way. Sadly, we're not getting any soul heart drops or anything. I know that they're, like, not super common anyways. So I, I shouldn't be expecting them, but I was really hoping. Yeah. Be careful with this fella. We are doing great damage, I will say. We're, we're kind of stomping through these rooms. Getting through that guy there quickly is uh, very nice. There you go. We got through to death. Champion death at that. Ow! You telefragged me, you ass. I don't like that. Ow! That wasn't really a telefrag, but I'm going to pretend it was. Give me another locust there. Ooh, this is nice. Although I don't like this little fella, because I could easily throw into him and accidentally take a deal of the devil. Or get hit by him, because I'm stupid. Either way, we are alive. Somehow. Somehow we, we live. Okay, so we'll check this room out here, but otherwise we'll just get going. Sadly, not a room we care about much at all. Okay, so these eyes are a real pain for this fight. So I think... I just want to say, if we hit this right, we can kind of use him as a blockade and just swing forever. I think that's the best way forward. It didn't really work as a full blockade there. We do have a nice... Oh, no, I got hit. A nice slowing fella there helping us out. Burn meal has been unlocked. Another devil deal that we can't utilize. Oh, heck. Where are you, big hand? Where are you, big chief? Oh, God, it, it was a burn hand. I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Nothing in there really interests me. I will quickly do that, just in case. Oh, up we go. I would, I would bet on death. <laughs> I think we're, uh, we're, we're in for a, we're in for a bit of a tough time here. Just given the nature of these rooms and the, the current health that we're on. What, what, these, these dudes are tanky. Okay. I, I am definitely dying. I have half a heart left. I would need some rapid injection of health. That is quite a rapid injection of health. Thank you. And spirit shackles. Nice. It's kind of helpful. Not a proper revive, but it's close. I need to actually take a quick little gander at how Spirit Shackles works. I don't know if I've ever used it effectively, and now could be the time. Upon death, Isaac tends to a ghost that is linked to Isaac's dead body and can continue fighting with half a heart. Ten seconds after this effect, Isaac comes back to life. Okay, pretty, pretty simple enough. We basically get a second chance every time we die. Okay. This is like a dire situation now, so let's just... Bomb all of these and hope for the best. We've got plenty of bombs. Golden chest isn't going to cut it. Can't take the risk. 
this has just been a difficult, difficult time. Another health up. Okay, this is unprecedented luck on, on the uh, in our final hour. Just gotta hope I'm going the right way. Okay, I've gone the right way. Now, Isaac is another story. I think Isaac is gonna be a real problem for us. Now, my hope is we can just block 95% of his shots and take basically no damage. But, by the way, where's my mended knife? Where did that go? Like, I've still got the item, but I don't see the knife anywhere. Like, at all. Oh god, oh god. He's escaped. Yeah, I don't, I don't see the mended knife at all. I don't know when it was eaten up when it was taken away from me, but I don't have it this fight, and I don't remember having it at all this floor, either. Why am I stood where I'm stood? I've just got to throw it, like, the perfect angle to get enough damage to get him to bugger off. I think this is going okay. I think... Oh, that was stupid. Oh, but because of revenge, that killed him. I didn't think it would. I'm surprised it did. But that was, that was kind of nice. Now, if we could get some items that give us some HP here, I'd be very grateful. A D4, you say? A D4. I think I can be persuaded by a D4. I think I can be persuaded by a D4. It's still broken? What? I thought they fixed this ages ago. Okay, I'm running on, like, a really old version of Ipecac, I think. Because this, this bug got fixed weeks ago. And I'm still having it. Not good for us, because we just lost a lot of our damage. And now we've got... We did gain some health, I will say. But I don't think this is going to go all too well for us. Yeah, this was, like, this got fixed ages ago. I don't know what, either I've got another conflict that's causing this issue, or I am on a really old version of Ipecac by mistake. But I don't think that's the case. I swear I checked that it was updated. Anyways, I will check again. I might just do a full reinstall of all of my mods just to make sure that everything is, uh, everything is to plan. That's not great. Okay, well, that was, uh, interesting. I think another reroll will, will cycle us away from planetarium items anyways, so... Let's not worry about it for too long. Good. Tears up as well. Beautiful. What is going on with... Oh, okay. Okay. That's what's going on. That was strange. What's with the bloody Eternal Champions game? Stop. I'm somehow doing okay, though. Oh, God. Well, I don't know how I escaped that room there. Okay, they're not Eternal if you escape and re-enter. At least I know that now. can barely pick him up. He's so small. Ow. I can't... Li I literally can't hit him. Okay. Reroll again. We still got some planetary items, but most of them are gone. Ow. Got hit again. Oh, God. There's a lot of these dudes, isn't there? Holy hell. We've got quite high range. I think that's one of the reasons I'm having trouble here. The question is, can we fight the boss like this? I mean, for one, I've gone the wrong way, apparently. I didn't think I was going the wrong way, but seems like I have. Oh, God. There's an Eternal Boy in here. What just hit me? I don't even know. 
Definitely one of these herming shots, but I don't know which one by who. Could, this is this is terrible. I can't I can't pick up my guy. Eternal, you're gone. Okay, thank you. That was tricky. How the hell do we get to this boss fight? Okay. It's just Q battery is what it is. Opened that secret room for us, thank you. Reroll again. We still got like a, a good bunch of planetarium items here, no matter what. Which is kind of weird. More fire rate and a half soul heart. Kind of need that. Apparently I used Mars by accident there, I think. Oh my god, what is Mars doing? We also have a lot of burns on us right now. Whoa. Don't know what caused that. Honestly, don't know what to think of this. Okay, so for one, I'm not actually hitting him right now. I need to relocate my buddy because I'm, I'm literally not hitting Blue Baby at all. My, if you can see, my range is like gone way past where he's sitting. So, I mean, it's it's kind of working somehow. Oh god, I'm on half a heart. I do have a revive though, which could end up being very beneficial. I don't know though. I don't know. Okay, now that he's moving around, we have more issues. Oh my god, this is just horrible. Okay, we got him. I don't know how we survived that, but we did. Anyways, I'm gonna go and like reinstall all my mods to make sure they're working correctly. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.